Hi Canucks fans, I've got some interesting news for you today. So, on the 32 Thoughts, the podcast, Elliot Friedman from Sportsnet raised the question of whether the Chicago Blackhawks might turn to free agency to bring in some top-level talent to support our boy Connor Bedard. I'm talking players like Vladimir Tarasenko or Max Domi. What's your take on this? Let me know in the comments below. Now, shifting gears to our beloved Vancouver Canucks. The word on the street is that the team isn't ruling out the possibility of re-signing goaltender Colin Delia, even though the odds may be against it. Money is tight for the Canucks, but they're exploring options to see if they can make some upgrades. Who knows, maybe Delia will find his way back into the mix. We'll have to wait and see. Speaking of roster moves, let's talk about Oliver Ekman Larson. Donnie and Daly recently had a chat with his agent, Kevin Epp, about what's next for OEL after the Canucks bought out the remaining four years of his contract. And you know what? It's all about finding the right fit for Ekman Larson. Kevin Epp mentioned that every player is different, and for OEL, there are multiple factors to consider. Of course, playing for a competitive team with a chance to win is crucial. They're looking at his role, how he'll be utilized, and where he'll fit within the roster. But it's not just about hockey. Lifestyle and family also come into play. Where does he want to live and be? It's important to find a place that suits his personal life too. And let's not forget the nitty-gritty details, like the contract itself. Salary, term, and compensation for each season are all significant factors. It's a complex puzzle, and the market will ultimately determine what's in store for Eggman Larson. So, Canucks fans, what do you think OEL should prioritize in his new team? Do you have any suggestions or predictions? Drop a comment below and let's get the discussion going. And hey, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any more Canucks updates. Can't wait to hear your thoughts.